what an amazing golf shot. Which then went a little bit right and maybe in a... Oh no, it's okay, I just see you there. <laughs> oh, I hold my breath, I thought that might have been in the... Uh... The bad stuff. That was pretty awesome, that. So, guys, we're down here at Alzora. I'll let you go and get your driver, Peter. Oh, Explain thank you very much. Oh, you do the intro? We're down here at Alzora, brand new golf course, not even open yet. 9th of December it opens. Uh, and we've just played nine holes on my channel, which was a match play. And if you've not seen it, definitely go and check it out. And that's a complete lie because we didn't play nine holes, we only played six. Because there's only actually six holes cut out on the golf course at the moment. And that is a complete lie. <laughs> and I just completely lied to you. Um, what's going to be fantastic about this six holes that we're going to play is the course on two or three of the holes is going to look completely different. Yeah. For a couple, couple of reasons. One, the sunset. The sun's going to start to set over the city of Ajman, which we can just see over there. And I'll just darken the picture up to show you. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> so the sunset's going to kick over that hill soon and the tide comes in. So some of the holes are actually tidal based. So there's water where, they, uh, where there was wasteland a minute ago. We are on the, can't remember what hole number. It's the one where you almost killed. Tenth. It's the one tenth. where you almost killed someone first time round. This is the 10th. <laughs> this is the 10th. This is the uh, great escape hole. I'm gonna call it, because it was a great escape out of a bunker. We're also doing a little bit of 4K video sequencing here hopefully new pictures for the golf studio. So put a good swing on it. Will do. I was happy with mine. Oh wow, that's even better. You are driving it great. So guys, if you've not seen part one, do or the first stage of this, do go and check it out, because Pete's been hitting it wonderfully, and that's another almost green-driven drive. Right, let's head on. Rightio. Right here. So Rick has just ran round the edge of the... Uh, I'm actually quite scared to get too close to this ball. The waste here. It's gone. That was, I think both lucky and unlucky, because it was a really good drive a that yard, we thought was great. A yard further left and it would have been near to where yours was. Well, let's not get too crazy, because well, this hole, by the way, I don't want to I don't want to get too braggy, but I'm almost on the green and it's 380. It was a good drive, though. <laughs> so I'm going to just land it, just pop it short. One bounce and just get it to check. I like it. Tricky green, this one. Big humps and swales all over the place. Let's see. Whoa. No. Whoa. No. 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 Stop. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry for trying to add some drama. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> Still you, buddy. Go yeah, you go. <laughs> I like how you make it easy for me on camera. I appreciate it. I've not made it any easier anyway. <laughs> so he's just got to come up here over the swale down to the green. Again, another tricky shot. Lots of these little runoff areas here at Alzora with really tight uh, lies as well. Not easy at all. No, stay. I'm gonna go again, Pete. You wanna go again? Please. Okay. <laughs> I just wanna get this out of the way now. Okay. <laughs> Guys, if you've not seen <laughs> part one and two on my channel. You can, you can maybe ignore part one and two. <laughs> oh, God. Oh! <laughs> that would have been some par. <laughs> God, take it away. I feel sorry for me. Take it away. Okay, so I've had five and you've had one at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, funny game, eh? Funny oh. game. What could have been? So. I was just saying, these runoff areas are so tight. Well, I think they're the most hard. I think they're the hardest things ever. So, uh. Pete's chipping for eagle. Basically, you got you got three shots from here, mate. Chip and okay. two putts, and it's yours. Okay. I'd have loved to have chipped that in. That would have been. That would have been good. <laughs> that'd have been some four. So you shouldn't move a little off the left, I think. It's got a little 52 chip and run. Oh, nicely played. Start to swing. Start to swing. Start to swing. Eagle, and drop. Eagle, 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 eagle. Oh. That is so on the edge. 
I was trying to focus on the zoom. Right, well that's sped up the play. One up for you, Pete. Let's Thank get on to the much. next hole. Right, so what we actually decided to do, this was before we came out, that Pete's part would be stroke play. Yeah, we got a little bit excited there. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to honour that, even though none of us finished the hole out. Uh, Pete had a three, I had a five. So I Pete well, I is... I think to save times, we'll still give gimmies. Because we're, we're going to be running low on daylight soon. Yeah, so. it's going to look amazing though. Oh my, wait for this, you ready for this, you ready for this, right, right, right. <laughs> Right, let me go 4,000. Okay. It's like the city just comes alive behind. It's quite amazing. Right, back in the game. Uh, this is the fourth hole in normal play. Normal quite a difficult par four, which we both hit the bunker last time, but we put, we're going to play off a tee further forward this time. And this is the first time we've actually even seen tee markers on the course. That new. And look how new they are. They are literally brand new. Not even been put in the floor fully yet. <laughs> Darren Clark's playing here tomorrow, so they're getting ready for him. Mm, not sure about that, bud. Oh, I don't know if it might have hopped it. It was going at the bunkers I was in before. It was. I was trying to get a nice old draw on it, but I think that was the, what the people call it, an overdraw? A hook. That was an overdraw. <laughs> Uh, I'm going to go just obviously right of that line. There's a little bit of space in, those, in between the bunkers, but I'd be very lucky if it's found any space there. Now that is in literally the same place we hit it before. <laughs> Get left. Yeah, it's good. Good? Yeah. Yeah, very good, mate. Well played. So Pete's just found the bunker. A different bunker to what he found last time. He's off a different tee, but he's still found the bunker. He's got 150 yards left in this flag. Now, as seasoned players here, we know what this green does. And by the way, let me show you this again. You ready? Look at that. That's what we can see. That's what it looks like in our eyes. Amazing. Right. Back in the game. So, what are you going to hit? Um, <laughs> in the sudden, the ball. I think I can just about get the seven to it. Yeah, you've not got a huge lip to get over there. It's not lying great. It's, really? Think, yeah, it's a bit weird because it's all flat, but it's got like a little ridge just behind it. So that the contact has to be perfect. But, that's what we're here to do. That's what you're here to do. Think about your tips that you did, how to hit a bunk shop perfect. Well, there are any of those out of the fairway bunkers, yeah. <laughs> Oh, that is bloody amazing. Travel. Travel. Ah. Oh. Bunker. Hit the top edge and went back in. Oh, yeah, you can just about make it out. I'm lucky, so I'm just over here on the right to actually hit a fairway, which is nice. Let's go and play it. So it's got about 150 as well into this hole. It's a little bit into breeze, isn't it? Into and off the right, yeah. It's going to knock in a seven, which is not my forte, but I need to learn this shot. Well, we both agree that's your best ever swing when you do a little knockdown shot, so. I'll do my best. <laughs> All for camera, my friend. It feels like I'm chipping it. And I just need to stay just right at that pin. Yeah. Wow. Oh. Wow. Well, that. Absolutely diabolical. That wasn't the best swing you've ever done. Brilliant. Might have been a good technical swing. <laughs> Not strike. strike. <laughs> okay. Here we go, PD. So close to being good. Mine was so close to being terrible. I'm in the bunker on the right, Pete's here on the bunker on the left. He's probably got a much easier shot than me. Dreadful strike of mine then. I was trying to be too fancy with it. That's a really nice bunker shot. It's a really good shot. So Rick is a long way below me here. <laughs> it's like looking down at someone from a cloud. So I've got a harder bunker shot here. Yeah, much, shot much harder. This slope is very, very steep. It's got a big like bowl lump in the middle. It's somehow got to negotiate. Try and land it, use that slope. Struck it amazing. Spin. You just hit the back edge of it. 
That was unlucky. That was a great contact. That was unlucky, that. But very struggling with this ball. Anyway, two puts for par. Really? See if we got one. All right. Two each. What, you're not going to put? <laughs> <laughs> <Two each. laughs> so Rick, after the bunker shot, is down here. It should move off the left slightly. Yeah, I would say. I think maybe just a little bit. Nice shadows now. It's coming down, coming down. Move, move. I think I fatted that. Fatted? I think I haven't been my most stellar two holes. Fatted so it? Yeah. <laughs> He's haven't been my most stellar two holes. <laughs> A little bit rushed at the moment with this daylight, so yeah, we're running in a bit, aren't we? <sighs> Breathe, nice marker. Thank you. So, this is for the win of this hole. Well, to take a three shot advantage after two when you're playing six holes. <laughs> <laughs> Good up and down, good par after going in two bunkers, right? Par five, par five next. And I'm three shots back. I don't worry. So we've, uh, as, as our passage of new newbies, we've actually kicked the golf monthly team off this tee. <laughs> so move over, guys. It's us to go. Andrew just hit them some amazing shots. I got lucky oh, sometimes. Yeah. Coming back here. Yeah. Oh my so word. we're off the black tees here. And this is the difference between the two parts, guys. Yes. The water now coming in. If you'd have seen my part, this wasn't as pretty as what it is now. And that's some. Look at this backdrop. Let me show you this. Let me let me four thousand it up. Okay, enough of that, because we've literally got 13 minutes of memory. <laughs> go! <laughs> so it's not as aggressive line up down here this time. We can go a little bit further right. A little bit further on the right. Yeah, nice drive, sir. Yeah. You might just be 50 yards behind Andrew there. Is that okay? I think that's the difference in how old are you now? <laughs> Uh, 22 now, 61. Uh, Probably about a yard a year, I reckon it could be. <laughs> it could be 40 yards in front. You, not me. <laughs> That's pretty good. It's the same line, Pete. Yeah, same line. Well, I think I've just got my thumbnail anyway. <laughs> That's pretty perfect. Isn't it? <laughs> it's not bad, is it? Oh, what an incredible looking hole. All right, mate. Good one off here. Oh, stop it. Smoke. Absolutely rip that, mate. Okay. Fantastic. On this tea forever. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got about 250 to go here with Rick. Fantastic drive. Uh, there's three flags there up on the green. We're going for the far left one. So the one on the left hand side, which is bang pretty much in the middle of the actual uh, green. I'm just going to pause for one moment because Rick's sorting himself out. So right is your friend down here. Right is the friend. So we can't go left because you're going to be in the mangrove. So Rick's going to be aiming about there and giving it a good old ding dong. What a beautiful strike. That was an incredible strike down the right side. I might have put it into the Yip Valley again, but I'll take it. <laughs> yeah, there's a little valley down there to the right. Cracking strike again. Though. So this is what we're talking about. You ready for this? I'm going to do that and I'm just going to do this. That is an amazing shot on this. This was an amazing drive. So we've got probably about 2.30 left in. 2.30, so I'm going to hit the same shot as I did before. Yeah. Like well, I think you can go straight at it. Yeah, I'm going to go a little bit right because... If you if you knock this on, it's pretty much game over and don't bother watching part two, basically. So don't ruin don't part, like part two for... Don't ruin part two, everyone, Pete. <laughs> you played the game mate, you played the game. Well done. Thank you. Safe. <laughs> Sorry, did I put you off then? No, no, not off. Okay Pete, so um, not quite in the Valley of Sin. No, and no. I'm also not quite in the Valley I'm just on the hill of the Valley of Sin, which is a blessing. I did it too well enough to get into the Valley of Sin. No, and I, I did it mine really well. So there are three flags up there because we were doing some shooting before, but we're going to go to the flag on the left. We definitely don't want to go to the flag on the right because that's quite harsh. So flag on the left. Front and rolling down yeah. a bit. Big bounce. Oh, stopped 
mightily quick. I ate that very well, to be fair. I think Good. I should have just got it that little bit more, but... Hey, hey. look at that battery. I know I'll keep doing this. 4,000 it. Bang. Bang! Like a city emerges. So Rick's going to wimp it and put it. <laughs> <laughs> That's not what you said, camera. <laughs> I did just say that is the right choice and he wasn't wimping out, but... Clearly, we're going to have to aim at the other flag. Yeah, so it's going to aim at this flag to get to that flag, the flag that we're actually going at. Could have gone so much more up green. It's all right. Two putts for birdie. Go, come on, go, 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 go. Go on to the front one, yeah? Yeah. I've hit that so badly. Was well, a little bit on the soft side, it must be admitted. So still a chance for a bird. Yeah, you wish. <laughs> you wish, brethren. Well, that was quite a dreadful putt, and this is going to make up for it. I like quite it. Stunning putt. Whoa. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Well, you can tap it in and take it away. Up to you. I'm going to attempt to tap it in, but if it doesn't go in, I'm going to take it away. Okay. Well tapped in. Well, that was uh, another disappointing five on this hole, <laughs> weirdly. Yeah, it seems we've both been up here very much in line with the pin in two shots on both occasions. You could rectify this though by knocking this in. You know what? I'm going to do that. For you. I'm going to try and make this look quite dramatic. Yeah, just if you're going to beat me, proper beat me. Wow. Well, I've literally no idea how that stayed out. So. Wow. I was actually, if I'm being honest with you, I was too busy uh, changing the moody setting so we could see the backdrop. Right, guys, part one done. Do join us in part two because I'm, I'm still within a chance. Indeed. Light is dying, so we're really, really going to have time to play two more holes. No, last part three. Is... Three really? holes. Come on, let's go. Subscribe, tell people subscribe, and then go to part two. Go. Uh, subscribe, subscribe and come on to part two. Uh, get. <laughs> Part two, see you soon.